as the city played host to Ireland's president. On her first overseas trip as head of state, Mary McAleese came to mark the 100th birthday of Queensland's famous Irish Association. The music and grey skies made the Irish president feel at home. First stop on her tour, the Queensland Irish Association, Australia's oldest and largest. The club invited the president to help celebrate its centenary. It was a bit of a lark, but she came. I wanted to personally thank you as the president of Ireland for this renowned family home that you have created at the very heart of Brisbane. Hundreds then attended a civic reception for President McAleese at City Hall, where she was greeted by indigenous dancers, including one Irish Aborigine. One in three Australians claim Irish descent, the other two wish they were. <laughs> In fact, Australia is the most Irish country outside Ireland. Thousands migrated here. Many didn't have a choice. Somebody did say they were selected by the finest judges in England. <laughs> and they certainly proved their worth when they got here. The cavalcade then headed to the Mater Hospital, where this professor of law, who was educated by the Sisters of Mercy, opened the Queensland Diabetes Centre. Colin Daly, 7 Nightly News.